as an entrepreneur, today is very difficult, and tomorrow is even more difficult. But the day of tomorrow is very beautiful. Most people die tomorrow evening. You have to work hard, you have to learn, you have to rely on your team. When I started my business in 1995, it was very difficult. I had an idea, I invited 24 of my friends in my apartment because that year I went to Seattle, first time, my first trip to the USA. I never touched computer in my life before because computer was so expensive to me and so complicated. After two hours of explaining what I'm gonna do, internet, and 23 of them say, forget it. He said, this thing never worked because there's no such thing called internet in the world. You know nothing about a computer. So why you wanna do this? Only one people. He said, Jack, if you wanna try it, just to try it. But if there's something wrong, just come back. And uh, after a whole night thinking, I say, I still wanna do it. Because most of the people, they have a fancy ideas in the evening, but in the day, when they wake up in the evening or in the morning, they go back to do the same job. We have to do something different. When we're in an apartment, I say, guys, in the next 10 years, or in, in, in the future, Alibaba will be the top 10 websites of the world. And my founders look at me and say, what does 10, number 10 mean? Today we are ranking like a 500 million something at the back. But you have to believe it. I think as an entrepreneur, if everything is ready, that does not need you. Because nothing's ready, that needs entrepreneurship. Just to finish the first 100 meters yet. Do not think the people beside you is a competitor. Running for another 3,000 meters, then you know who is competitor. The Netscape was so good, we never thought it would disappear. Yahoo was good, we never thought like it today. So don't believe you'll be good all the time. Be paranoid. The thing I learned from being a teacher, that you, a teacher, always want his students to be more successful and better than you are. So this is, I learned to be a good CEO. 